Hello and welcome back one more time to our trusty i3 sub project. Uh, when you last saw me I was uh, considering some pretty serious brain surgery but I'm pleased to announce we got it. Observe. And here we go. We are running. As you can see, we have throttle control. Now, I'm not sure whether that maximum speed we're hitting there is just down to the uh, power supply that I have there, or um, whether it's, just, it's actually down to some of the settings that I've in the controller at the minute. But, you know, we can actually if I just pump the throttle there, you can kind of get the motor to shake a little bit, which should be telling me we are putting a bit of torque in there. And this is running in sensorless mode. Um, and even at full throttle there now, we're pretty much only drawing about one or two amps at about 40 volts, um, which is very impressive. Uh, I take back all the things I say about it being crazy. Um, that was me that was being crazy, uh, not the brain. I just had to figure out a bunch of the settings, and so I watched uh, some YouTube videos from Ireland hands more and played around with some of the settings now Starting is still a bit of a problem uh, Because we're not running Hall sensors So if I let the motor coast down and keeping in mind we have regen turned off here just because I'm running on a power supply But if I let the motor coast down to a stop I'm gonna get you guys in close to the ro rotor here if I go back on, of course this time it starts perfectly, so I'll try and get it to catch again because sometimes it will rock back a little bit. There it goes. No, oh, it managed to bounce off it. This is typical. <laughs> okay, so there we go. It's basically locked. Now, so no, no matter what I do with the throttle, it won't... Uh, move but if I just rotate the motor slightly in the direction of rotation and it's gonna rock back again <laughs> I can get nothing to work on camera let's go forward a bit more hit the throttle again there we go so that's it guys uh, Lebowski brain is back in the land of sanity. I'm very impressed with that for sensorless operation. So, next thing that we'll have to do will be to use this guy, our trusty Texas Instruments Resol Resolver to Digital Converter Board to see if we if we can run in censored mode because that guy actually puts out a commutation signal which is what our Lebowski brain wants to see so try and keep this one short again uh, just another quick update to let you know we now have a working brain um, just not up here it's on the PCB so as I said don't forget to like subscribe share and check out those links and uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video, guys. Oh, almost forgot. Happy sensorless motor driving.